Do you like comic books? Yeah? What is up YouTube? Spectacular Spider Grandpa uh, coming at you with his Man Cave 2017 uh, tour. I saw everybody was doing this, you know, giving updates on their uh, Man Cave and I uh, wanted to get in on it, um, start off the new year, see how it looks. So, starting right here, this was a gift from uh, my brother from Blaster to Stash at Huey's Comics. Um, he made this light switch cover for me, so... And if you can look, it's really hard to see. My room's kind of dark, but the light switch um, is actually Spider-Man's penis. So that was awesome. All right, moving right up along this wall here, I got some um, Spider-Man hanging on the wall there. Some old-time movie uh, tins. I have the alien and the predator right there. I got Leatherface. I got some other... Uh, movie related stuff. I got an empty bottle of Sailor Jerry's right there. Notice I said empty. Um, yeah, nothing much going on up here but Leatherface. Um, some more little knickknacks up here. Um, House of a Thousand Corpses figures. A lot of the, a lot of those small things like the My Little Pony stuff are things I find at work on the, on the sales floor and everything I just throw in my pocket. There's my uh, Superman lunchbox I've had since uh, I was very young. Um, that's from the original Christopher Reeves Superman movie. Just uh, more stuff up there. Here is a remembrance of movie stop of the old movie stop sign I used to buy my comics from uh, they were Hastings owned and one of our best friends worked in there and uh, both me and my wife filled in from part, part filled in from time to time to help her out and um, right here is actually my wife's uh, name badge so um, moving right along um, Jack and Jill went up the hill, a book of nursery, zombie nursery rhymes. I won a contest and have that book sent to me, autographed by the author. Um, <clears throat> let me close the laundry doors here. I got a Hulk, Incredible Hulk mouse pad on the wall. A 3D Friday the 13th. Um, I don't know what you would call it, just a, something to put on the wall. A little Walking Dead picture. Uh, TV guide with The Walking Dead on it and a painted Lord of the Rings uh, picture down here over here is my box of double comics co doubles of comics I have right over here is a lot of my Funko Pops um, about three layers deep so and then on the lower shelf if you guys could see, I got dorbs stuck in there. A bunch of dorbs. When I get them now and then, I just shove them in there. Um, these are the laundry room doors right here. Well, not the laundry room, but that's where the washer and dryer are. And I got um, a Spider Gwen print right there. I have an amazing Spider Man uh, sticky thing right there. And then I'll close this door. And I got some more classic Amazing Spider-Man covers right there. Above that, I got some Clyde Barker action figures uh, from the Infernal Parade. Devil's Rejects, uh, more Infernal Parade. Um, a couple pops, one I just got, Axel Rose and Lummy Kil Kilmster from Motorhead. Another Infernal, Infernal Parade. Uh, Cosmo, another Funko specialty series, more action figures, um, my Princess Leia, uh, Sail Barge, uh, action figure, rest in peace, Carrie Fisher, uh, some tin movie tickets, I thought that was pretty cool. Coming down here, we got, um, 
an ultimate warrior um, minifig and the Hulk Hogan Funko Pop and back behind this sign right here is a, a Sopranos painting one of my favorite TV shows ever um, I got a Back to the Future Hot Wheels and down here is a Loot Crate exclusive Dr. Emmett Brown moving right along I got uh, a skeleton nutcracker uh, Walking Dead um, I forgot what size they are but they're huge um, down here I got some classic Walking Dead figures a little dusty but still in the package and my Walking Dead uh, Michonne bobblehead um, just a little sign my mom had made for me and right down here this is for my grandson when he gets older um, I got this for his first, first birthday baby's first comic book August 3rd 2016 that is Spidey number one the Scotty Young variant uh, moving right along uh, a Freddy hand puppet that my mom found for me a bottle of actual True Blood from the True Blood TV show uh, Legion of the Collectors um, Wonder Woman Invisible Jet the first ever Walking Dead magazine Krampus with a hot dog sign back there moving right along I got some more Hot Wheels this is actually a door right here. Um, I'll show you what's inside the door when I uh, get finished here. Uh, Aquaman, Mr. Freeze, the Joker, he's cool. Um, <coughs> excuse me, Two-Face. Um, I got Luke Skywalker right here. Some classic uh, Marvel Moon Knight right here and the Taskmaster. Um, Arrow from the Arrow TV show, Joker from the Suicide Squad, Harley from the Suicide Squad, a bunch of Star Wars Hot Wheels right here, going down, and this is the bottom of the door right here, Let's see if a better view, more Funkos. I got uh, Marvel Select Wolverine, Daredevil, and Black Widow, uh, four times Stanley Cup champions, and you know I'm a Shark fan guys, I love the Shark movies, Shark comics, my all time favorite movie poster is Jaws with the X-Men Origins Wolverine uh, foam hand, so behind this door. I'm gonna go ahead and open it. It's really hard to see in here. It is a bunch of packing. This is the water heater? Bunch of packing materials, and I have. It's really hard to see. Um, let me try to get some light in here. That might be a little better, but I have Funkos upon Funkos stacked up on these shelves in here. So that's where a lot of them are as well. I got a table sitting here for when I do the live Blast of the Stash It show. Close this door back up. All right. Moving right along. I got a bunch of collectibles up here. Bunch of collectibles right there. I got reaction figures from Black Canary and Arrow from the Green Arrow. My little knight figure right there. Um, one of my co workers drew this for me and I put it in a frame. Spider Gwen, if you don't know, she's awesome. Some, I don't know, they're hard to see back there. Gears of War action figures. My only copy of Amazing Fantasy I'll ever have, and it's a. Uh, it's a tin. Right down here, <clears throat> I got more Funkos right here. And this is the left side of my entertainment center. I got Walking Dead box sets and a door there. More Walking Dead box sets and some other stuff. And more box sets of The Walking Dead. 
going straight up um, a Sons of Anarchy little thing and a bunch of mystery minis I got my Detroit Lions Go Lions helmet right here with a skull in it bunch of uh, action figures up here this was the first ever picture of my grandson right here I, I have it up there and if, as you can see guys I have pops all lined up behind all these action figures this is the top of my entertainment center um, all, all these great action these action figures and pops behind them um, got E.T. chilling up there I got my Exorcist Pop one of my favorite horror movies ever with the Linda Blair signed uh, picture I uh, purchased from um, Houdat Comics thank you again Houdat shout out to you my brother um, then right there's the headphones I use on the Blasted Show behind my TV right here I got two Walking Dead pictures and Tom and Jerry right there um, my TV as you can see Cat Ren figures is on I was watching YouTube videos before I left for the LCS so shout out to Cat Ren um, moving right along down here this is the thing my um, TV sits on I got a little Hulk thing right there um, Xbox One and a picture of my grandparents who I miss dearly and that was a little coin holder my grandfather used to have um, I still have it um, some more pops down here um, this is the left side or the right side of my entertainment center I got a bunch of Disney stuff going on in here um, some aliens and Predator Funkos and some uh, magazines back there my PS4 and this is my newer backdrop of when I do videos on uh, or the blast it show so these are just more Funko Pops they're constantly changing out I'm constantly changing out um, so there's where we drew the winner of the Santa Who contest comic books my gold BB-8 uh, more Funkos down here my puppy is bothering me now trying to bite the camera so moving right above that I got the Jedi banner right there and all my Walking Dead Funkos right above this 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 room used to be a garage so and as you can see the chains going um, in front of the camera I'll show you what that is here in a second um, I bought this on Halloween it's this long string of chains I bought this at Walgreens I thought it was pretty cool so I just hung it up so over there is Baby Mort. A lot of you know the story of Baby Mort. It was a gift to me um, from my mother. She always likes to send me Halloween gifts, so I got that. Uh, the Miles Morales mask. My Spider Gwen and more mystery mini stuff. And Spider Man just chilling up there. Love me some Spider Gwen. Um, this. I think it was one of the first ever awesome acts of kindness I got from OMG. This print. Uh, right here by Mindy Wheeler of course a spider Gwen statue there Venom, Spidey more Funkos right there um, the first season of The Walking Dead poster some Entertainment Weekly Walking Dead and the second season of The Walking Dead then starts my couch um, up top there I got some other stuff, uh, Sidney Crosby Funko, Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone, that's what it's called in Europe, 
and sometimes this is my backdrop also for videos that I do. Um, my Spider Gwen Legends figure, uh, Flash, Spidey on a little motorcycle, Leatherface and Michael Myers back there, Flash and Arrow TV guide, some more action figures, my Green Goblin I'm very happy to have right there. Um, another one of my favorite horror movies, Night of the Living Dead, that's actual DVD in there. Um, Walking Dead, Walking Dead, horror related Funkos right up here, Metallica Whiplash vinyl behind there, more stuff right here, that spam thing's actually a bank, I'll, I'll probably get rid of that soon, some rock candies, one of my favorite movies ever, um, The Crow. It's dirty. Um, Punisher Legends. Um, from this is from BGG. Um, he got this signed for me. Um, it, it's signed by Ar Ariel Olivetti. Olivetti. Um, as you can see on there, maybe it says to Spider Grandpa, and he signed it. BGG got this done for me. Big shout out to him. Um, picture of my grandson um, right here is a picture that Trinity Comics my brother and blaster to stash it uh, drew for me when I bought this Funko Pop from him it says uh, Mike thanks for buying the pop hope you enjoy it bro Trinity Comics I got that to that's the first thing I ever bought from him um, Nightwing over there, the Legends Taskmaster. Oh man. Walking Dead magazine, Walking Dead magazine. Moving right along, more horror related Funkos. Um, right next to it, it's really hard to see, is my Lita VHS that she signed for me. Um, let me step over here. Uh, Wonder Woman, Metal Die Cast, some random stuff that's been given to me over the years. These are more recent right here, the Marvel Rock Candy uh, Mystique, She-Ra, my autographed um, Flash Gordon, um, Doom 143, I won his contest, I got this J. Scott Campbell lithograph, I guess you wouldn't want to call it. Right down here, I also bought this from uh, Trinity Comics. This is his Chase Alien from Independence Day. Everyone remember Creech? Right next to Creech. We got my Hellboy. Love that thing. Love Hellboy. My Garbage Pail Kid Mystery Mini Collection right here. Um, this just recent Wolverine's Motorcycle. My Spider Gwen mug. Um, my Darth Vader, uh, what the hell are they called? Hikari, Agent Venom chilling right there. Doctor Strange mug. Um, that's very bright. Uh, got a Deadpool, um, Marvel Selects, Thanos Marvel Select, Red Hulk, Grey Hulk, um, Zombie Sabretooth. And the Green Hulk right there. Um, I got some Star Wars, Marvel, and DC encyclopedias right there. Um, going right here is a McFarlane Dragon. And I'm really happy to have this whole set right here. This is uh, McFarlane's Monsters, Twisted Fairy Tales, Miss Muffet, Hansel, Gretel, um... What the hell is his name? Peter Park or Peter Pumpkin Eater, Red Riding Hood, and Humpty Dumpty way up there. Now right here is my Star Wars shelf. Um, let's see if I can't put some more light up there. Um, lots of great stuff going on up there. All Star Wars related. Um. This ain't half of it. A lot of the stuff is upstairs in the attic that I had to pack away. 
So just a bunch of random Star Wars stuff. Star Wars stuff and a shy guy right there. Star Wars Funkos, my Blu-rays, random junk thrown on the shelf. Funkos. More Funkos. Blu-rays, more Funkos. Uh, these are, bought these a long time ago. Clone Wars uh, commemorative boxes. And my Darth Vader replica lightsaber. I don't know if I could turn it on. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Right under there, I got comics um, waiting for bags and boards and long boxes that I still have to get. Um, right here, uh, more Funkos. Uh, my Star Wars poster, I absolutely love that. My Godfather little plaque there. Uh, green, another Green Arrow figure. Harley Quinn. Um, Hit Girl. Another Harley Quinn right here. Some more um, Walking Dead action figures. This House of a Thousand Corpses mini poster I got at OzFest one year. I absolutely love that movie. Um, it's another Harley Quinn action figure. The DC Superhero Girls action figure right here. Um, Gotham Before the Legend. Selena Kyle action figure. One of my favorite characters. My Daryl Walking Dead poster right there. Um some Batmobile Hot Wheels my grandson just tore one of them down that's why there's the empty space right there these Star Tours you could only get these at Disney World right here action figures Zombie Sump On Penny Blake and Andrea from The Walking Dead and then this poster right here is done by a local artist there's only 600 of these posters made right here. Awesome Walking Dead poster. Um, but yeah, that's that's my man cave. Um, like I said, this room used to be a garage. And I'm not a car guy by no means. So we, when we bought this house, I turned it into my room. And that is that. Um, so yeah, guys, that that's that's Grandpa's man cave. I do have other collectibles in other rooms. I might do a video one time to show those off. But for now, um, that is it. And uh, you guys, uh, be kind to of one.